Ready, steady, go. And Gunter Lukas is off. He's training hard. For the past 36 years, Lukas has competed in athletic events, and this year is no exception. The 70-year-old isn't alone. He embodies the vibrant spirit of Germany's elderly today. When I turned 60, I didn't say, OK, it's time to slow down. I set a goal instead, fit at 100. I want to live to 100 and be healthy at that age. I try to hang out with young people in the family to stay fit. Whether it works is another question. Young and old work out together at the German Sport University in Cologne. It has set up a special institute for mobility and sport for the elderly. If you look at the polls where the elderly are asked about their long-term goals, they want to remain physically and mentally fit as long as they can. That's what we have to focus on. We have to find a way to help realize that goal. Professor Mechling says that's especially important in Germany, where the population is aging fast. So he developed the Fit at 100 exercise program. Mrs. Scholl is already 101, but she still takes part in the workouts with all the 80 and 90 year olds. The training group is a fixture at this senior center. The workouts concentrate on strengthening the arms, legs, mind and soul. It's good for me. I wanted to participate right from the start. I knew it couldn't get worse, only better, and I do feel better. We really encourage mobility, and especially social interaction as well. The fact that the residents come here twice a week at a set time shows that they like it, and they feel the benefits. German pensioners have more money at their disposal than ever before, and more of them want to remain fit and healthy. It's nice, but I don't need it yet. When I do, I'll come back. Department stores have taken notice of Germany's growing elderly population. They've started to cater to older customers, expanding the variety of products and zoning in on what they call the best ages. We've really started to focus on the best agers, the customers who are in their 50s and 60s. These are the people we often see in our stores. They're still mobile and they have fun shopping. They might be refurbishing their home or buying something nice to wear. That target group is very important to us. That's why department store Galeria Kaufhof has started producing ads featuring older models. These days, aging is no longer a negative. Germany's senior citizens are wealthier and fitter than ever. The focus is on maintaining a good quality of life, especially because Germany's elderly are living an average of 10 years longer than the previous generation. If you start leading a healthy lifestyle early on, nowadays you have the chance to retire and live a relatively long, healthy life. Nobody can guarantee immortality or that you'll maximize your age, but you can definitely prolong the period of time that you're still in good physical and mental shape. Günther Lukas is trying to do just that. He's taking part in a study on how to build up muscle in old age. The weight training program shows Günther can improve his performance, something he wants to continue in his 70s. I try to push young people to be as fit as I believe I am right now. Günther Lukas's grandchildren are already receiving recognition for their involvement in athletics. He's proud of his own certificates of achievement too, 36 in all, one for each year he's competed. And he hopes there's many more to come.